Welcome to the Ado and Luna channel. On today's video, we're going to be opening up 30 blind boxes and 10 of these were gifted by Kika Goods. So thank you Kika Goods for the PR. Let's go ahead and jump into unboxing and I think we're going to start with Foodie Dinosaur and this is from the designer Dog Dog Pang Pang and the brand Toy Zero Plus. It is a smaller series. We only have six options and as you can see on the other side, we have two secrets. I'm really, really hoping for one of the secrets. They look incredible. I would love to get a secret. And for our regular series, I really like this purple sky one. I think these bottom two look really good, but this is the one I'm most excited about. The top two I like as well. I think the two that I'm okay without are maybe the metallic ones. But let's go ahead and open this up. This is such a cute packaging. And if you noticed, for all of the blind boxes we have today, we have two of each. So we're going to be able to open up two of every series I have. I thought that would be really fun if we opened up two of every series. Ooh, I'm so excited to open this series up. I've been excited for this one. Ooh, we got the one on the cover. Oh, I love the blue of this. Oh, I really like our apple dinosaur. This one is so cute. We can see some snow. I just really, really love the color though. This teal is just really striking and these are soft fubu, I believe. So they're a bit of a lighter material and I really like it. I think these are so cute. And here is our card for snow mount. And who are we going to get for our second one? I'm hoping for the secret or my midnight one. I do have one more box of this that I'm saving for a treasure trove video. So I do have one more of these to get the one that I'm hoping for. I really, really want the purple one. So hopefully I get it inside of here. Ooh, no, we got the other purple one though. I loved this one. This one is so cute. And all of them have that apple on top, but I think this one kind of looks like a peach. And I really love the grapey purple color of this one. The colors for this series are so pretty. And if you really like this dinosaur design, they do do larger figures as well. And a lot more designer toys instead of blind boxes. And here's our card for Magic Momen. That name is so cute. And here's a look at our two foodie dinosaurs. This pair looks so cute. What a great start to the video. And I'm so excited to open this series. I think this definitely has to be our next one. This is our Emma Coffee Shop Secret Forest series from Lucky Emma. And we have eight designs and two secrets. This is one of my favorites. It's supposed to be a crepe design. The two secrets are really cute. We have like a bag of coffee and then I think a coffee bean one. And on the other side, we can see four of the other designs. I'm not a big coffee drinker, so I think the only one for this one that I'm really excited for is the blue bubble tea drink. I think the bubble tea one looks so cute. I'm so excited to open this series. It just came out, so I'm so excited that Kika Goods sent this to me. I did ask for this particular series. I gotta pick it out. And I'm so excited. Both of my boxes were pretty light, so I think there's a good chance maybe I got the smoothie or the crepe one that I'm really excited about. But let's have a look at the first figure. Oh, cute. Oh, this design is really awesome too. It looks like an ice cube at the top. And I can't tell if these are supposed to be sugar cubes, ice cubes, or salt. I really love her earrings though that we have made out of the cubes and the clear vinyl for the hat is awesome. And I think this series is really adorable. They put two series out back to back. I think I prefer the other carnival one, but this cafe series is also super cute. It's so hard to decide between two of them. And here's a look at our two cards that came inside. Her name is Sugar Cube. All right, are you excited to see who comes in our second box? I am. I'm really hoping it's our smoothie or our crepe one. I just really love the colors for that design. Ooh, this one definitely looks big. 
Oh, I don't think I got either of the figure that I was really excited for, but let's open it up and see. Oh, we got the crepe. Oh, I didn't think it was the crepe. Oh, this looks so cute. Oh, I love the design for this. This one is adorable. I really love her pastel colors. She is just like the perfect figure. And I really love her cute little cherries. They look so adorable. She even has a strawberry. I just really love everything about this figure. Oh, and her ears look so cute. She has long loop bunny ears. And she looks so cute in her bonnet. I really love the Lolita fashion vibes for all of the figures. They look adorable. I think she's going to look so cute with our sugar cube. I'm so happy that Kika Good sent these to me. And here's the card for Crepe. And here's a look at both of our sugar cube and our crepe together. And don't they look so cute and pastel? I was really excited for the figures and they look amazing in person. I love them. And I think maybe next we should open up another thing sent from Kika Goods. I asked for these really cute cat squid blind bags. And they don't really show you much about what's going to be inside, but I was really excited for these. They are the Octocats Summer Party Series. And I really, really like anything cat themed, so I just had to pick these up. I thought this would be such a fun thing to open. And of course these are mini, so we're going to have a bunch on the inside. Oh, this bag is really hard to open though. We should have a smaller bag on the inside. Let's have a look. Ooh, yeah. Oh, look at how cute the bag is. Oh, I love the bag it comes in. And I think we have three inside of here. Or maybe, oh no, I think we have four. So we have all four of our cute little mini bags now. And these cute minis are from the brand Strawberry Musetta, or I think that might be the character. Ooh, we got a flocked one right away. Oh, uh, this is why I loved this series. There's flocked ones. And this is our cute corgi patterned one. So this looks like a corgi dog, I believe. And it's flocked. It is so cute. And I love how it is a little squiddy. Squiddies are so cute. Okay, let's open up our next one. I hope it's another flocked one. Oh, it's a regular one. Ooh, and look at the colors. This is a cat one instead of a dog one. Wow, I think the paint on this one is so pretty. This might be my favorite color we get today. Oh, I'm so excited we have another bag of this so we can open up eight of these. Ooh, this one's really, really cute as well. We have a white one. And I think this one is a bit metallic as well for the white. All right, we have one more from our first bag. Ooh, this one is cute. We have a little brown kitty. These minis are so cute. I really love this style of them. And the cute little octopus cat combo is adorable. And I'm so excited to open up our second bag of these. And I really hope we get a flocked one for every bag. That would be so awesome. I really loved the flocked one we got. It's so cute. Oh, and this is our first clear vinyl one, and it is black and clear. This one is really cool. I'm always a sucker for clear vinyl, and I'll have to check to see if these glow in the dark at all. All right, and who is in our second one? Ooh, this one is cool. Oh, I love the colors for this one. And we have a little watermelon cat squid. Who is in this one? Ooh, this one is pretty, and I think this is kind of supposed to be like a soft matte color. And the finish for these ones feels really cool. I like it. Oh, our tealy squid is just so adorable. I really like the color for this one. I'm a big teal fan. This series is really adorable. I'm so excited I got these. And we didn't get another flocked one, but we did get another clear one. Ooh, and I love the blue for this one. This one is such a pretty color. I really love when minis have a bunch of different finishes. I don't know about you, but I've been finding the Pop Mart ones so boring. 
And here's a look at all eight of the cute little cat squids that I unboxed. These are all super adorable. I think my favorites are definitely the first one we opened because it was flocked and I love the pink metallic one. And I think next is the kind of matte finish for the blue one and then the clear vinyl in the blue and the black. I think I listed off almost all of them, but there was really no duds. These were all cute designs. I'm so excited about our next blind box as well. We have Baby Ghost Bear by Shinwu and Finding Unicorn, and this is Ghost Dinner. But this is the plush series that just came out a few weeks ago. And this series looks so cool. I'm so excited for pretty much any of these, but I love our secret. The secret is incredible. I really like our ice cream cone, and I love our chewing gum one. I think these two are the ones I'm hoping the most for. Our purple spaghetti themed one is cute, and the hot sauce one is amazing. I love the secret though, so it would be so cool to get a secret. And I haven't opened up a Shinwoo plushie series before. This is my first one. And I love the custom bags that Finding Unicorn does. Look at how cool that is. It says Strange Ghost Dinner and it has the cute burger from that series. And let's see who is inside. Oh, this is the cute spaghetti design one. This one is adorable. I do love how it's so purple. For a second, I thought maybe it was the secret edition, but the secret edition is in a donut. And it looks like we have a really awesome metal chain to attach it to a bag or a purse. And we even have a little metal detail that says the designer's name, Shin Woo, on it. That's a really nice touch. This really feels like good quality. I think this is going to be an awesome plush. I'm so excited I got this. And it even comes with a card still. Even though it's not a vinyl figure, it says Special Menu, Devil Kitty. I can't wait to see who we get inside of our second one. Oh, this is going to be so awesome. I'm really, really hoping it is the bubblegum one, although the hot sauce one is also really cute, and I think that's most people's favorites. Let's see who it is. Oh, it is the hot sauce. I thought it might be. It was so round and big. And look at the color. It is so vibrant. We have our cute heart attack sauce. Oh, I love the color of this. I don't think my camera is picking it up really well. This is so cute. It's so soft as well. These plushies are just adorable. Oh, I love them so much. And here's our card for heart attack sauce. And we have another mini series, so let's open it next. This is Bunny Tea Time, and this is from the same brand as our last mini series, Strawberry Musetta. Although, because this is in a blind box, we can see all of the different versions you can get. There is flocked ones in this series as well, and I believe the brand is also Nova XI, which does bunny plushies that I love. I definitely can't tell you all the ones that I'm excited for. We have like a million on the side, but let's go ahead and open this up and see who is on the inside. I think these are probably going to be in bags as well, just like the last one. And how many do we get? Oh, we got four again. Oh no, we only got three for this series. And the bags are really, really cute. And let's see who's in our first one. Oh, look at this one. This one is so pretty. I love the green. And these ones are a bit like Lolita themed with a little headpiece. And I know the face might not be for everyone, but I really like the face. I think it's really interesting. I like how we got a clear vinyl one to start. I hope we get a flocked one though. Ooh, and I did get a flocked one. The flocked ones are a bit rare, and this is one of my favorites. This is the purple and white cow pattern. Oh, I'm so excited I got this one. This one is so cute. Any of the flocked ones I would have loved though, they are adorable. Oh, I really love her. She is so cute. And let's have a look at our third bag. Ooh, this one is fun. Oh, I love the little nurse's patch on the forehead. 
The colors for this one are really vibrant with our red and our blue. And we did have one more at the bottom. So you do get four like the Cat Squid series. Ooh, this is one of the pearlescent ones. Look at how pretty this is. And this one is so beautiful. The way it catches in the light is so dreamy. This is just so pretty. And I'm guessing this finish is one of the rarest ones. We got really, really lucky with our pulls today to get two of the really awesome finishes. And let's open up our other box and take out our four figures. Thank you so much for Kika Goods for sending this PR to me. These are awesome. All right, I'm hoping for a second flocked one. Ooh, not a flocked one. Oh, we actually got a duplicate. Oh no. This one's really cute though. I think my best friend would really like and hopefully our second bag isn't a repeat. Oh, definitely not. Oh, it's a similar design though. It's just a different colorway. Ooh, I really like the pastel colors for this one. The yellow is so buttery. I definitely got lucky with my first box. Hopefully we get another cool one. Oh, we did get lucky. We got another flocked one and this one is in pink. Ooh, pretty. I really like the bow for this design. It is really cool and the ombre is very nice. Oh, I think she looks really, really cute. I like her. And we have one more box from Bunny Fantasy Honeyed Tea Time. I'm really hoping it's a duochrome one. Ooh, it isn't, but it is so pretty. Ooh, I love the colors for this one. That ombre on the ears down to the dark purple is so pretty. And here's a look at all eight of our Bunny Fantasy Honey Tea Time minis. They are really cute. They're definitely a bit more alternative than our cute cat squids, but I really like that. And I do like how there is different versions of the shape. So you can get a few different varieties for the actual figure. And then you have all of the different finishes. I love the flocked ones. I think they're amazing. I'm so happy I got a really metallic duochrome one. She is gorgeous. These are all really cute though. And maybe we should do these minis next. So we're done with our minis. This is Boy Yoon Pig Pig. And these are kind of like Chinese New Year Lucky Pig Minis. Let's go ahead and open it up. All right, and who do we have inside of our cute little pig bag? Oh, look at this one. It is a Meijong tile, but it is flocked. And we have a cute little pig butt in the back. Our piggy is just so cute. I really love this one. And I don't know for our second box if it's also flocked. I did pick these up, so these ones aren't surprises for me. But let's have a look at our second bag. And it is another flocked one. I, again, couldn't resist getting these super cute flocked pigs. And I think this one has a cute koi fish on the top. Or maybe it is a lucky goldfish. It's like a little hanger on piggy and I love it. It's so cute. I'm such a sucker for anything flocked and adorable. And here's a look at our two cute pig minis. They are super adorable and I'm so glad I picked these up from a reseller. And I think next we should go ahead and open up our full case. If you didn't know, this was a full case of Mofusan. I'm doing 